So the blue flesh mystery. And if you're not sure what I'm talking about, when you fish for lingcod, about 20% of these guys will come up with a kind of a tealish green hue to their actual color. So they have those brown spots, those brown highlights all over their body. But the green lingcod or blue lingcod, whatever you prefer, it's like in the whitish part of the fish. You'll just see this little tealish hue. And it freaks people out if they've never seen it. They're like, oh, something's wrong with my fish, which is absolutely not true. It's called Billy Verdon. I have to figure out how to pronounce that every single time. But it's caused by Billy Verdon, which is a pigment that builds up in the muscle tissue of the fish. Scientists do think that this may be related to diet genetics or potentially liver function. There's not an actual concrete reason why this happens, but the meat is totally safe. And when you actually fillet the fish, it will have that bluish green tint to it. When you cook it, it's going to turn white, just like the rest of them. Tastes totally the same. We've done a side-by-side -side taste test thinking is one different than the other. No, they're totally the same, <laughs> but I do want to show you what that looks like. Only 20% of these guys have it. Let me show you a picture of a regular link odd. So you can see this guy does not have that bluish hue and this guy does. 